As a musician, I like music for its creativity. I like it for its art, I like it for its passion. I like music because it's affected every human civilization, past, present, and future. I think it's one of those key things that makes us human. I think, I don't think there's been a human culture that hasn't been affected by music. And I bet it's gonna affect us for a lot longer. But, as a music educator, my primary concern is how music can be used to accomplish Ministry of Education and School Board initiatives. And that's what I'm gonna talk about today. Sir Guy Music, we are back with another edition of Sir Guy Music. Today we're looking at old yellow bricks by... Inquiry-based learning in the music program. Is it possible? Is it just too noisy? Is there no control? Is there disorder? Maybe a little. But maybe instead of loss of control, we could call it the sharing of leadership. Maybe instead of noise, we can call it, you know, practicing music. Inquiry-based learning is the way that I learned, how I learned how to play music with my friends in the basement. I don't think I would have responded well to some out-of-touch person teaching me music I didn't want to learn and waving his arms around in front of class. I might have found that hilarious. I don't think I would have been in music. Inquiry-based learning lets those kids explore, lets them be responsible for their projects, for their marks. It doesn't always work, but when it does, student engagement is maximized. Student participation is maximized. Negative behavior is minimized. When it does work, it's very fun. And the kids catch on. When it does work, it's worth it. All those lesson plans that you try your best to put together, Sometimes you have to scrap them and just go with the flow, share leadership, and engage the students. Growing success document. What does it mean to educators, students, parents, and those in the big office? Really, it gives students many opportunities to develop their skills and knowledge, to build on what they have, what they would like. It gives an educator many opportunities to assess those students, to see how they're building, how they're gaining future knowledge, and how they're sharing the evaluation process, where they can take a good hard look what has a student learned? Compare it to provincial norms. A proper grade level for, for parents. It gives them the sense of confidence in today's education system. Not only the educators, but to know that their children are being given many opportunities to develop the knowledge and skills required to be successful people Whether in today's music. Whether it be science, mathematics, social sciences. They will have a foundation in which to be have the opportunity system. to grow as learners and become self-sufficient learners. For administrators, it gives them the ability to look at their staff and say, hey, are you doing the best thing for them? The opportunity in which to show what they know in many different platforms. The benefits of growing success are just Huge. Some would say there is a plethora of opportunity and knowledge gaining ability hidden within the pages of this. In document. the music classroom, growing success affords the students the opportunity in which to take their knowledge and show their teacher in many small vignettes what they show their teacher in many small vignettes what they can do, what they would like to do, how they are processing. It gives this 
teacher the opportunity to say, hey, student A is really trying. They came in with zero ability, and look, they can play Mary Had a Little Lamb. Music is a critical component to our school improvement plan because um, at Sir Guy Carlton we're all about student engagement and finding ways for kids to get connected to and school. For a lot of our kids, music is their favorite class. It's a safe, fun, relaxed environment with an awesome teacher who's super cool. Yeah. Um, the kids love it and for a lot of those kids that's their favorite place and that's what brings them to school. Um, and it retains students and engage them in different ways. Um, before we had a music program, there was lots of kids who didn't you know find their niche or their special place. After we got a music program there was kids who you know were up on stage participating uh, in concerts who never got involved in anything before and so it really serves a, a need for a lot of our students. How's that? That's all you can ramble? You didn't even say Bipsa or Sipsa once. I said Sipsa. Say it again. Sipsa, 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 Bipsa, Bipsa, Bipsa. That's going in. <laughs> students to learn? I guess I want them to learn how to learn. I want them to learn work ethic. I want them to learn discipline. I want them to learn focus. I think as your lives are spiraling out spiraling of control and you find that you're just everywhere and make something beautiful and something special on an instrument through music. That's really something. When my students leave my class, they have a belief in themselves to be able to do that. And that's really important. You want to know if this will enrich their lives? I think it will. I think it will directly uh, enrich their lives, but I think it will also indirectly rich, enrich their lives. Let's say, uh, let's say they become a baseball player. If they know how to learn, they have the work ethic, the focus, the discipline, and a belief in their own abilities, that's good for them. They may never play an instrument ever again, but they may have learned all those traits in a music room, uh, whether they're a baseball player or a business person or truck driver or anything. Those are all important personal traits to develop, and I think music is a really strong way to do that in high school. Uh, what about directly, purely, if they were going to be a musician? Yes, well then... Music is directly responsible for them understanding what really goes into music and the arts in general, I think. Uh, if they can understand the work it takes to get good, good enough at something, to make something that sounds that good, they can really appreciate music. And if they learn music, it's going to change the way they hear music. Uh, which, if they're anything like me, they're going to love it.